It wasn't him, maybe it was Demon Hunter, but I, I remember seeing him. Alright, actually, they looks like they're off and running. Yep, there we go. Alright, right, so, I'm gonna try to focus... Oh man, it's gonna be tough. Uh, <laughs> I, normally I'd say you focus on what I focus on the other, but then they're just kind of doing stuff, all of them. So I guess, um, uh, like, Pinball Wiz immediately goes and gets a uh, blood drum in his uh, in his red chest on his 1-1. Yeah, man, quick oh blood man. drum is nice. Uh, it's hard. Yes. To, it's hard to use because you are sacrificing health every time you use it. You can use it for a lot of different things, though, because if on the beat after you beat the drum, you can deal. A lot of there are a lot of boss kills, a lot of shop kills, free stuff everywhere. Yep, you can use it to dig as oh, well. Um, here we go. Uh, J JT oh, is going to go for the. Yep, and he got it. Got the kill on the shopkeep. So, and he got a titanium dagger in his one one. And he got the blood the blood shopkeep. Killed him off. Also got a blood drum. And, and a Luminous Torch. Nice. We're already seeing some interesting builds happening here. Yeah, very interesting. I think the most... Well, let's see. It's semi... Um, actually, the, so right now it looks like Blue uh, blue Blim PSC, uh, Blue Blim uh, SC, and Dovanok are kind of baseline uh, builds right now. And they're ta they're taking more trap doors. It looks like JT and Pinball Wiz are taking the time to make builds. Pinball Wiz has a, a Glass Broadsword. And JT has a uh, rapier and a luminous torch and a blood drum. Interesting. Pinball wizard looks like just swapped out his uh, blood drum for an apple. Yeah, and I agree with that. I mean, if if you're starting off and you're not too familiar with the blood drum, I wouldn't I wouldn't run with it either. Yeah, I don't take it myself, but you know, I'm an extremely low tier player. All of a sudden, uh, I mean, I pretty... don't even have the skills of these guys to be honest with you. Oh, it looks and like I, a... I'm very uncomfortable with the blood drum, but. And only go with what you feel comfortable with, yeah. Yeah, commentate, uh, stay commentating four streams is kind of crazy right now. It's, uh, <laughs> it's, it's a thing. There's uh, a lot I'm, to look at. What going like, on? So it looks like JT also got a Ring of War. That's actually not bad. Not as bad as you guys think. Uh, especially for a newer player, you get knocked back, and that turns that rapier into a three damage rapier. Uh oh, it looks like we have some buffering on uh, Blimp's side. I like it. Uh, I'm good on. Oh, wait. Yeah, I think I have. Yeah, Ring of War is an interesting choice. There we go. Okay, buffering's gone. Yeah, well, Ring of War is pretty good. It, oh, ouch. Looks like Blip is actually having some difficulty, especially getting uh, uh, Blood Broadsword trolled. How's that? Mm. Cheese, though. Please eat your cheese. And he's buffering again. We're getting some buffering issues, at least for me. Yeah, I have the yeah, same. Yeah, he's buffering for me, too. I think it's probably uh, something with uh, his inner on Twitch. Yeah. Oh, actually, it went back in time. That's kind of weird. Um, I refreshed and back in time so anyways back to back to the other uh, racers if um we keep going it looks like actually uh all three of them are about to uh well l at least uh jt and pinball are in their uh, zone two to one and it looks like uh Dovinok is about to be in there as well yeah very Dovinok. similar pace everyone's kind of just getting through zone one right now gonna be on zone two one um with uh I see pinball was a little bit ahead, but I think that also my my stream delay on on, hit, on pinballs was I, just a little bit. I, I, I see pinball a lost his uh, glass weapon. He's now just got a one damage dagger effectively I, with the shard. Exactly. I'm not a very big fan of the glass broadsword because you get one range and that's. And it. he finds an obsidian cat. That's actually a good replacement. The game's like here. There you go, bro. That's really cool. So uh, it looks like, actually right now the strongest build in my opinion. Actually, it looks, like just picked, looks like Pinball picked up an Earthquake scroll. Oh, not bad, actually. You can show that Earth. That, but hopefully, if it keeps it, you can do that quick kill uh, strat I showed off on uh, the pre show. Um, I was about to say Dovanok had the strongest build because he had a titanium spear, but I'm looking at over at, um, uh, uh, sorry, uh, JT's uh, uh, stream right now, and nice. it looks like he, he's got a yeah, heavy plate. Uh, he did, he opted for uh, the Ring of Regeneration, and that's, that's not bad. That's a very good ring. So he's not, he's down uh, some health, uh, or not health, damage. Uh, so he's not doing two damage anymore, but he can now tank. He can actually take two hits if he wanted. There we go. He's having a little difficulty. Perfect. Oh no! It looks like I looked over at Pinball Wizard, went down. Ouch. Ooh. Oh, he Ouch. got the. Uh, uh, Armadilloed. Dude, do we have a. Uh, I don't have replays on. I'm yeah, not gonna do replays say. on the uh, four way. It's gonna be yeah. That, it's kind of crazy. Um. So yeah, I'm looking over. Uh, actually, right now the the two strongest are. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. We have some difficulties on. Uh. Oh no! JT went down. Oh, oh no. Yeah, actually, that armadillo. 
We're all back to, uh, I think, uh, I think the only one person who's still up is Blimp. And he's fighting Coral Rift. Oh, well, no, Blimp's not that far ahead. He's a, his own one boss. Yeah, Ouch. it's, it's going to be close. Um, I think what, ha like, you really have to keep your composure here and just try to do a, do a run like normal. Don't panic. It's, 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 I know these are, uh, for people, it's like, they're, I don't know if it's who's first time racing in an event, but. It looks um, like a glass bow pickup. I like the glass bow. It's so strong, and it has it's, so much range. For, bl uh, for Blimp it, there. It's, it's funny, one of the, the first times I saw this game in action, I watched iCasper play during the Necrothon, and uh, he, he uh, PB'd at the down. time Dragon. with a glass... Ooh, yeah. So he PB'd at the time with a Red Dragon. Oh, uh, the Red Dragon. <laughs> Red Dragon. He PB'd at the time with a glass bow. It was like six minutes at the time. It was really, really... Oh boy, there's a there's a trans that's a scroll of enchantment or whatever the orange scroll is with the glass bow right there. I would grab that bow and change it and see what it turns into. You can get a titanium bow, or you can get a any other yeah, type actually, of bow. Actually, that's not bad. You get the extra range. Let's see what he's gonna do with that. He's gonna okay. He's gonna take it. Hmm. I'm getting buffering it. on Blimp again. Yeah, I still, yeah, I'm very choppy on Blimp. He's but. he's constantly buffering right now. I think I think it might. Not sure if it's. I checked his bit rate. It's actually a pretty low bit rate, so I'm not too sure on that. Now, Jay's got a pickaxe, a blood rapier, chainmail, and sunglasses. Oh, ouch! And uh, pinball wizard went down again. Ooh. But yeah, it's um, uh, I, I like JT's build. Uh, pretty strong already. Looks like yep, and he managed to flawless deep blues. Very good, and he doesn't go for the boss chest. Interesting. Interesting. Oh. Maybe he's uh, maybe he feels under pressure to go fast after that those couple of deaths. Could be, or it could be maybe he's satisfied with the build he's got. I mean, he's got the blood drum, a few bombs. It looks like. And that that actually might be case. That might be the case. He's just thinking, oh, I have health. Oh, he has the sunglasses, so he has a two, da uh, three damage launch, two damage hit. That's effectively almost a titanium uh, uh, yeah. rapier, so that's not bad. Uh, let's see, blimp, blimp here, blimp is just re uh, buffering at me a lot. So, um, yeah, just while, look, looking over at, at Dovanok's side right now, it looks like looks he has. Like it looks like blimp decided to keep the uh, titanium broadsword over the bow. Yeah, I don't mind that choice because he did try to transmute the. He tried to change the bow, and it turned into a gold bow, which is kind oh. of not a not what you're looking for when you're changing the, wow. the bow. <laughs> Game's like, you know what's better than a glass bow? A gold bow! <laughs> and that hey, is, it's great uh, Great if you're trying to score, Ron. <laughs> yeah, I know. So, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Not, not so much for speed running. Exactly. Actually, there's a potion room on Bloom's side. And, and now, you get the bombs, and he's probably just going to use the bombs to open up the potion room if he sees it. He's going for his leprechaun, actually. Very good call. But if I yeah. were him, I would I would have used the dragon probably in this case to make a build happen. Use the dragon to, to punch through that wall and get that potion. Ah, uh, Dovenok down again. I missed what killed him though. Ooh, ouch! Yeah, because I'm looking up at uh, JT's side. JT's actually on three two now. Very decent build. Uh, still with rocking that chainmail pickaxe. Oh, he and got blood conged. Ooh, you know I, I noticed um I noticed that uh, a lot of the time. With, uh, like, that's weird. Uh, with Konga stuff, a lot of players have trouble with Konga for some reason. Like, Death Metal and Konga, two of the harder ones, because that, that one pause causes all those issues. The, and the beat, I, like, the one I'm skip beat. I'm getting slightly better with Konga with Melody, but I'm still not great. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, it, actually, it looks like Pinball Wizard also went down, too. I missed that one Ooh. as well. Uh, a, lot of, to... a lot of deaths here. Well, but I, I've I noticed think... that. I've noticed yeah. that with the conduit, though. That the first few races, it seems like there's just a lot of deaths. A, a lot, of, a lot of nerves. A lot yeah, of nerves. Yeah, a lot uh, of nerves. Because I, I like to quote, like uh, I talked to Sorati, he first raced conduit, and um, at first, uh, like she, because uh, I told her there are a lot of nerves. I, I, ooh, and Dovanok went down again. Ouch! She got raced. Ouch. Um, so uh, and she, she said, "I think I'll do all right," and then she raced. And she, first thing she said was, "That was so nerve-wracking. Wow, I yeah, can't I remember believe how the nervous first, I was." I, I remember the first uh, conduit, and I asked some of the racers, you know, what were the nerves like, and uh, they said the nerves were real. They're very real. Ooh, okay. So it looks like, uh, okay, good. JT, JT got good armor, but he took a ton of damage. Oh. Uh, and he, so he, and he finally he got that that blood uh, blood rapier proc. Not too bad. Okay, there we go. It's just, oh, and JT's got my favorite torch. 
the infernal torch. It's a good torch. It's a it's a pretty like it's in terms of brightness, it's okay. But yeah, it's it's great because it, it gives you all those um, intentional and often accidental uh, kills. Yeah. I like. It looks like a uh, blip is actually not too far behind with uh, with a similar build. He has a ring of man and no spells. But I was trying to do out. Melody Deathless, and that was uh, actually the first torch I got in when my first run. And I was able to get a red dragon kill with it, but unfortunately, it Ooh. dunked on the next level. BT went down to death. He, got, he, oh. he bathed in that. Well, didn't bathe in fire, but he rocked out a little too hard there. Yeah. Ouch. But and so it looks like Blip is now actually in the lead with a, a, a build I'm not too comfortable with solely because of the lack of armor. If, yeah. he, if he had maybe some spells, he has. if he has, gets a spell for that ring of mana... He does have a perfect. defense charm. Eh, that's leather armor, right? It'll yeah. like take right now. He could take one Minotaur uh, to the face. That's really <laughs> that, that's. That, I mean, you don't want to, but you could. Yeah. And Dovenot here... Pound. Well, he had a glass longsword, but now we got a runner. Ooh, oh, yeah. In the death metal fight. Yeah, I don't I'm think he's gonna get too. a. He's not gonna be able to get a new weapon here. That's what I, you the, want. Best part was that you said we got a runner. It was death metal running away. From uh, Cadence, <laughs> like, oh, yeah, we sure do. But uh, I'm just looking at Blip now. It looks like he's uh, kind of taking his time. It looks like he's trying to look to maybe possibly replace that that broadsword. That, that's a terrible look. feeling going into Zone Two with just a base dagger. Oh, it's pretty bad. I agree. Yeah, but Blimp is definitely in the lead. It jumps down to three three, but he can pull here. The um, Pinball Wizard has a Blood Bow now. Uh, the Cheater uh -huh. Shoes. Uh, Ring of Charisma, and he's got, you know, praise ham. Yeah, pra praise the ham. I try, I try to try to imitate Cobalt Streaks, you know, uh, praise the sun uh, uh, thing. I, I do an okay job. But yeah, definitely praise ham, everybody. We need Cadence here, I swear. We really yes, need we, we need Cadence. Praise ham, kill me. But <laughs> <laughs> That thing so is just absolutely terrifying and hilarious at the same time. Yeah, exactly. Oh, hey, Dolvanok just got a good pickup, too. He got, uh, he replaced that glass shard with an obsidian longsword. Very, very nice, good. very nice weapon. It looks like Blimp is taking his time. Actually, I don't blame him. He also got an obsidian longsword as well, actually. Um, Although, if you're if you're new to the game, obsidian can be scary. It can, because you have to keep track of your damage. Yep. You have to, because... You, you, I've you, made that mistake hit. more than once. Exactly. You get hit, suddenly you're down to one damage. How come I'm not one shotting this dragon? Oh yeah, because I missed a beat. Exactly. Oh, okay, Blimp was doing a little bit of buffering on my side, not too bad. Back to the, and he's handling Konga pretty well. And JT looked like picked up a, uh, is that a jewel dagger? It is a jewel dagger indeed. Oh, I love it. And a crown of thorns, oh, I love, nice. I almost PB, like, I almost had like a six minute time with the jewel dagger, because it's great nice. when you get it early. Because you, yeah. you could bust barrels, you could kill uh, actually um, most bosses in one shot. Uh, two shot death metal, uh, most mini bosses are gone. Being a death quickly. metal, JT is in death metal now. Oh, oh, bounce trap troll. Okay, there. Oh, ouch. Oh, got sniped by that yellow skeleton right at the Ooh. end. So it looks like Dovanok is still in zone. He's in 2 2, and he's uh, passing up that titanium cat. I, that's my favorite weapon, but I, I understand. Oh, did Blimp just weapon. crash? The, I'm no, getting Blimp loading. Is, I'm getting Blimp's... a loading video on him. Uh, Blimp is still going for me. I see Blimp okay. in Zone Four right now. Uh, it'll is be it... it'll be interesting. That Blimp's the first racer today to reach Zone Four, and we'll see how yeah. it goes because Zone Four is the trickiest zone for sure. Like there's lots oh, of it's... tricks it, to it. <laughs> it took me it took me more than a month to adapt to it. It was uh, before when I first started playing this game. Zone Three was just the worst one for me. Now it's Zone Four. Even now, I still have trouble. I'm getting better. But I still have trouble with it. Like I, I, you know, wall pig or anything really, pretty much. There's so many things you have to keep track of, and there's so many enemies that require you to kind of like hit and move, and or or force you to move when you hit them. <laughs> exactly. See, because because you know most of the other zones are just a, a build check. Really, it's just oh, zone three. I could probably survive the swarm if I have three damage. I can uh, shoot. The, the the hardest part is going through the skeleton riders, the black skeleton riders. Hit, hit through the shields and knock them out, and kill them. Uh, but so four, you have to actually dance. And actually, I'm getting some buffering on his side, on Blimp's side again. Okay, there we go. We're back. He just killed off a troll as well. So you we know, with a jewel jack dagger, if you get a holster and another good weapon like a like Old Faithful or uh, 
city and longsword, you're really in good shape there. It, it really is, and actually, there, there's another plus about the jewel dagger: five damage, and you can quick kill most of your bosses. Like that, that uh, the the core rift that just happened it was excellent. What a great, what a great kill. Yeah. And so let's see. Um, Dovanok has a uh, base build right now. Has an apple back in a uh, one one, trying to find out your build. Um, to oop. Okay, there we go. Whoo! Minotaur, please. There we go. And then we're also dealing, it looks like uh, Pinball Wizard is also dealing with Death Metal on Zone 1 as well. Not a bad build, but it would be better if we had something better than just the uh, base uh, flail. Yeah, well, you know, the flail can go pretty far. It does oh, yeah. fizzle out a bit in Zone 4, though. Mainly because of the, of the uh, two reasons. Oh, actually, three now, now that I'm thinking about it. Obviously, first off, the Blade Masters. Uh, because if they're right in front of you... And all gets you... a Squaga suit out of his boss chest. Ah, oh, yes. I mean, I'm, I'm so sorry to hear that, Pinball. <laughs> Praise the suit! But really, uh, it's... <laughs> I mean, actually, that's a big thing, to be honest. Especially when we were doing... I was doing the Melody, uh, the Melody races, uh, commentating for... Uh, he, just, was like... he just took a Blood Shrine and got a Blood Whip out of it. I like oh, the Blood Shrine, especially he has so much armor. If he can just start to build, like, you know, 10, 10 if, kills, and he'll he'll start yeah, to get, um, you know, build the health back a, and let him survive. Although he got a whip, so, I mean, he's really <laughs> not going. A little bit unfortunate to get yeah, the whip. Yeah, this whole thing. Yeah, ooh, he's got to watch in this area, too, with all the bosses. Ooh, okay, got very lucky with that bat. He, he hit the bat twice, uh, and you know, still have one health left. The bat moved down instead of, you know, any other direction. J did. JT just went down in zone three. Ooh, got yes. swarmed a little oh, bit. Yeah. Um, are tough. Just a time Very check right tough. here. We're at 16 minutes and 50 seconds. Almost 17 minutes. That means we only have three more minutes in this round. It's looking pretty unlikely that um, either yeah, we're gonna get a finish. of the it top th uh, of the three of our racers are going to finish. But we do have uh, Blue Blimp who is in zone four, so has a good shot here. As if. Uh, he can survive. Yeah, pretty, I, pretty decent shot. He did a really good job. He did a really good job uh, pacing himself. That's right. Matt Kirby says credit to Blimp, slow and steady. That's a really yeah, good that, strategy. That was a really good. I think he went down once, right? And then he decided, okay, you know what? I'm going to take a little bit more time, make a build happen, look for things, and uh, knock out any loose enemies coming at me. Because one of the hardest things when you go really fast is you can get swarmed because you ignore a ton of things going toward the exit, and then suddenly you, now you have the mini boss and everything coming at you, mm -hmm. and everything following you. So. Uh, so he took his time, knocked things out. He's like, I'm not comfortable with the situation. I'm going to move out of the way here and just kill these creatures, make sure they don't uh, come to bite me in the butt later. That's always a good thing. Ooh, yeah. ouch, and Dovanok got... He, he got chest. Ooh, he got pawned. Ch ch checkmate, Dovanok, checkmate. But, um... Ouch, though. But, yeah, it looks like, uh... Oh, man, Blimp is just buffering a ton for me. Yeah, uh -huh. me too. You're spending some time in the Conjurer shop. Maybe you're gonna get some boots. Wait, uh... I think that might be what he's looking for. Uh, he can get one. He can transmute one thing. So he's really deciding on what to get. I'm gonna go for here. Zone he four for? is a, definitely a good zone to kind of slow it down a little bit. Oh, especially yeah, actually boots. Yeah, Sweetie Biscuit have a good a good choice. Yeah, Ring of Peace is not a good pickup. You're right on four three. Um, because you're on you're already on zone four three. Uh, yeah. You don't need it anymore. You don't need it anymore. It makes no difference. Uh, you could uh, definitely go for something a little better, like the Ring Regeneration. That was a good, good call. Uh, guaranteed health. He, he actually has a Squiggy suit he picked up recently. That's not bad either. So he's got a whole lot more health now. Dovanok with a gold crossbow? Gold? Oh, ooh. Oh, boy. There's a weapon you don't see used very often. Yeah, that's, um, it's, it's Although a thing. Although a gold crossbow was the weapon that, uh, where I actually was able to clear Zone 1 with Dorian for the first time. Ah, yeah, that's true. Uh, long, range really helps Dorian. That's I like, I I like admit, a crossbow. Although I have to admit, uh, Frog Socks with a crossbow is a very intriguing combination. Oh, oh, a, uh, you, or in other words, rough. <laughs> I'm just going to reload. Oh, I switched the Frog right. Socks off. Time me. is running low yeah, for, and that's, for, and for that's Blimp. Killed me. But... Yep. Blimp oh, is Blimp, on Blimp Dead actually, Ringer, so well, it's, Dead Ringer. Pretty, it, it's gonna be go. close. He does have the fast strat for Dead Ringer. That's a really good fight. Really good. You can tell he practiced it, and that's actually probably uh, that's one of the the bosses I worried about. That killed me a ton. He also has enough bombs here to use on the Necrodancer, which is a big deal. Um, yeah. Yep. I don't oh, know is how... he gonna go for the throw strat? Yep. There we go. Throw strat. Very good. Or 
Now, how many bombs does he have? Do you know? He had five when he went in. Five. Perfect. One more shot. Oh, monkey. Yeah, there really go. good. The bomb, the monkey took out the, or the bomb took out the monkey. Um, it's close. It might be. I don't know if he has enough time to finish. I do have a. We had a lot of buffering, so he did have some delay. It'll be up to the refs here yeah, if he, yeah, actually, if he actually get, finishes in time. Well, My timer. They all, they all closed out for me. It looks like Blimp it, it probably finished it actually. Well, it, so our refs, we have a strict time limit of 20 minutes. So if he finishes uh, within 20 minutes, um, it'll count. But our refs are, are have their official timer. Oh, that was a really yep. fast answer fight good, too. Good so the question oh, is, what's his buffering? What's his stream delay for me? More or less than 30 seconds, and we'll find out the answer to this in a second. See, see, I really liked, I really liked how he approached that. He at the end, he made this build happen. He's like, okay, I'm comfortable now. I'm gonna do a quick strat on Dead Ringer, and let's just go as quickly as possible on Necrodancer, the two hardest fights, in my opinion. Uh, but he actually played a very good game, good slow buildup, and guaranteed, i not guaranteed I'm not going to die, but pretty strong I'm not going to die build. Yeah, no, he did a really good job. I don't think, I don't think he did die early, or if he did, it was super early, because uh, his, I think, um, according to the refs, he finished uh, in, in real time at about 50, oh. like under 16 minutes, so it was... Wow, so, it, yeah, wow. He we have a lot of delay on, on Blimp's stream, but he did a really good job of uh, yeah. keeping... Oh. Looks like he went offline too. So maybe he's resetting or something. That um, might be a good idea, yeah. Or maybe he's readjusting his OBS settings. Yeah. Let me uh, award his points. So so Blimp does get the finish, gets first place in that first round, so gets four points. And uh, the other three racers get zero for that round because they didn't finish, and they'll probably try to make an adjustment here and make sure that they can actually get a finish. That's that's my guess. Though. Yeah. I I really like Blimp's uh, approach. He took his he took his time. And he uh, made, made it happen, and he said, "Okay, I'm not comfortable with this. Uh, I'm not." Uh, he he went to an area, saw a lot of creatures. He thought, "I'm gonna wipe them out first, because I don't want to go to the boss and then get swarmed." And that was a really good call. Uh, you awarded four points. Um, that's right. It should be three. Thank you. And game two. Okay, so he was at he was at fifteen fifty four. That was his actual man. We were really far behind. Wow. Oh. Not a problem. Yeah, he. It looks like he turned his quality settings down a tad bit. Let's see. Uh, Stats. Oh, you know what? I lost oh, yeah. him. Uh, hold on. Okay. Yeah, it's um. Yeah, he 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 cranked his settings down. That should help him a ton. Yeah. You're right, Spooty. Actually, he didn't die. You're right. He did not die. Um, he uh, he just took his time. I thought he did only because we're at approaching the 20 minute mark. I thought, oh yeah, maybe he died once. No, I I was, the, I think I was watching a pinball. He had the uh, glass broadsword. He died, and th then um, uh, Blimp had the. Uh, Titanium Broadsword, and I thought that was it, so. All right, Azona, take care, man. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for watching. I hope you get to uh, come back and watch. Uh, we're going to be around for a while here. We got uh, quite a few more races to go, so catch you later. Those three points are going to be huge for Blimp in this tournament right now, or this heat anyways. That gives him yeah. a huge advantage. Well, yeah, he could, he could play second in the next round and still come out far ahead, so... Oh, he couldn't even place third. Yeah, I'm pretty sure if he finishes the run, he's going to advance. <laughs> it's true. Because no one can, you know, uh, surpass his points with a win. Well, yeah, actually, yeah, the most anyone else can get is three points, right? Right. Exactly. Hey. So that means at worst, he's going to be tied for first place after this. Exactly. exactly. And it's Oh, that's robots. right. So he will advance. <laughs> yeah. Guaranteed. So he's, gu he's guaranteed that he's going to advance. Well, that, Speaking of robots, feels really hey, good. DJ. Sorry oh, we that. got DJC in here. Mr. Coda himself. Yeah. Right, Coda robot. Coda right. bot. All right, and they're off. They are all off. <laughs> all right. And it uh, looks like Blimp uh, turned his, uh, his uh, bit rate down. So, yep, much better now. So, here we go. Uh, very, uh, it looks like uh, Dovanok got an immediate spear. Oh, JT got bad. a frost dagger pickup. Ooh, that's EC. Now, if you get one damage, uh, an extra damage on that, it's actually not bad. Because now you have two damage, you can kill most things off uh, really quick, and you get piercing. And you get the freezing. Yep. And looks like he actually uh, pinball. No, no, sorry, JT passed up the uh, blood shop with a uh, titanium rapier in it. Not sure if I agree with that. Probably doesn't ah. feel comfortable trying to kill him off. No. Yeah. Actually, he wouldn't be able to kill it off because. Blood glass uh, pick up for uh, pinball. Yep, and Dovanok is going for that Frost Charm for one and a half hearts. I mean, it's, it's a bit rough, but it could help a lot going in. 
Oh, that so extra hit can yeah, that extra Ooh. hit can sometimes really pay off. And you're right though. It's it's a difference uh, between um, you know getting one shot by a dragon, spite three hearts, and taking a hit. And it looks like okay, yeah, it looks like uh, JT's now down to one two. Uh, Pinball Wizard's got the deal with it. Glasses, uh, a nice uh, pickaxe and uh, obsidian longsword. Nice. Nice war drum kill of a red dragon by Dovanok. Ooh. Yeah, using the war nice. drum well, I mean, using all the little things well is something that is really hard for newer players. So it's imp impressive to see anyone, like, using their resources really well. <laughs> That's yeah. the thing that, like, when I'm racing, I always forget about, like, oh, I have a war drum, or oh, I have, uh, you know, all these exactly. things that are they're different each run. All, it's all the little yeah. things, exactly. And it looks like uh, Blimp uh, went to a shop and he sees a ring of might that's really strong. And he kind of sat there deciding on things for a moment. I think oh, he's going to I got himself that, another that free hit, picked up uh, some glass armor and a glass shovel. So he's got two free hits now. And uh, Pinball Wizard actually has a free hit as well. He's got the crown teleportation along with the luminous nice. torch so he can now see what's hitting him. Good thing. This time Bl um, Blimp is... He uh, didn't take a... A base cat on the ground, keeping electing to keep the dagger, and has a very, very minimal build. <laughs> it's very interesting. And, but, it, but it, you know, I think I know what his strategy is. He wanted a guaranteed win for the first round, and I was actually going to try to take off. And look at that, it paid off. He got a, a mimic chest, and that popped out uh, uh, Old Faithful uh, to take nice. longsword. It's very, very find. strong. Yeah, he, he's good. Looks like he's going a little faster now. I think he's thinking, okay, now I, I have first. I can now. An infernal, here. infernal torch pick up by uh, Blim. Always. Always a good thing. You know what the best part about Infernal Torch is? Uh, is when you kill uh, a boss on accident by hitting a wall just by dig buffering, and you just think, planned, planned it. Yeah. I, I meant to do that. Yeah, to uh, totally meant to do that, guys. <laughs> oh, and look at JT's build. Ooh, wow, I did that not catch is, that. Uh, was that, was that, a, was that an urn? Or was that I, a 3-3 shot? Honestly, shock? I missed that. Well, he does oh, have a ring of darkness, so... It could have been a shop. Yeah, it looks like he wiped out the shop. There's nothing left in there. No items. Oh in there. no! Well, no, he didn't wipe the shop out. It looks like he got a ring. Of, uh, he got a shrine of darkness. Yeah, so I mean, he he, he took yeah. all the he took all of the items from the shop. I, I like. I mean, how does that look to the perspective of the shopkeeper? He's just sitting there, and suddenly the items just like float <laughs> in midair and then walk away. And <laughs> Seriously. He's like, it's like, oh look, it's. Uh, and he uh, replaces his blood flail with a glass flail. Oh, I wonder which he's gonna take. I, <laughs> that's very, flail very flail dangerous. Flail. That's that's not a that's not a terribly good. Build. I mean, the flail boots could call. I think he wanted the damage, but not sure if I agree with that. Even at one damage, that flail is still really strong, and yeah. he loses it immediately. So yeah, better going back for that. Flail. Oh. <laughs> Yep, I'd, embrace, I'd be going back for that blood flail. The blood flail. The other thing, oh, yeah, with, I love you. With the armor, he's going to be able to build up some health too, which will help to yeah. survive because he has Definitely super will. strong armor. It picked up. Uh, what did he pick Pinball up? Pinball wizard found a vault. Oh, oh hey, he wiped it out. It had the uh, it had the heavy plate uh, armor heavy in plate. it. Yeah, heavy plate. Yeah, heavy plate. I like the ch I like that change. And ham. Praise, Praise ham. ham. Praise ham. Kill me, but. Uh, really, yeah, it's 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 a really good, really good thing. I love the fact now that vaults can do that for you. And that's a nice build that uh, Pinball Wizard's got. Got the Luck Charm. Uh, what is that? Ring of Regeneration. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, ash, ouch! Sorry, Pinball the Wizard's Bright getting, Torch. The heavy getting, plate. It was getting uh, temporarily dunked by that very large black skeleton. Obsidian, Obsidian Longsword. Oh, the giant black skellies. Ugh. So it looks like the only person without armor right now is Blue Blimp. Uh, funnily enough, because uh, uh, he's he's kind of going semi fast. I think it's he slowed down a little bit in zone two, taking his time a little bit more. Um, not a bad. I mean, not a bad time. Four and a half minutes and two two. Not too bad. Holy water pickup for uh, Blimp. And that's going to help him a lot in the future. If he gets swarmed, he can knock out a lot of things. And he, uh, look at that. Uh, well, he's he got two. To, gonna go for bomb that. the blood Sweet. shrine, but he passed up the ring. I wonder if he's going to come back for it. I, I think he. I think he is. He's gonna go for the swinger suit. Praise the suit. Oh yes. Yeah. Oh man, I'm, I'm. I'm very proud. I'm. I'm very proud of you, my young Padawan. So we, we had to get a. We had to get a, a sound file of you saying praise the suit, Squigga. I. I probably should. If I. If I ever get partner, like it someday. I want. I, the, obviously, the first emote is the Squigga suit. That's obviously a given. With, with the bow ties. Oh god! Actually, I, you know what I want? I want, I want, uh, I want the cadence to say praise the suit. 
But I want. Boy, the the Dovalak had a monstrous uh, shopkeeper. Oh wow! <laughs> Alec, but hey, he got he got. Will he take right the boots of pain? No. Nope. Got a squega suit. I, I I agree with that because I do too. Uh, he honestly, has, he has he has a long sword. Uh, you can't really use it. You can, I mean, it's useful for say, uh, for uh, barrels, but it's not really useful for any. And then he has a obsidian longsword and a ring of uh, courage, so he has two damage base. Kill one thing now, it's three damage. And those are five also things. probably the most trolly boots in the game because if you're not paying attention, you try to pick them up and you're dead. He did. Yeah. He did jump on it immediately after opening a, a barrel. Oh no, he got yeah, the conjure. That's right. He conjured those boots and then yeah. jumped on them immediately. I don't know if he intent Oops. if he right right recognized it or just was a purchase so, and jump on it kind of so, thing. We have uh, this 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 entire uh, race is very heavy right now. Two heavy plates, two squaggy suits. Uh, yeah. I don't know about you guys. I'm team squaggy suit. I, I, I mean, I, uh, yeah. I, I, I might be a little biased. But uh, yeah, I like the squaggy suit better. Oh, but and a ring of wonder on Blimp's side. That nice. is awesome. Yes, best, best ring in the game. Dink is crying right now. He's like, no glass, no glass. <laughs> The heavy uh, plate allows you to do some things like um, it stops you from getting wind spelled, and it also allows you to jump on bounce traps without getting. And, and, the, and the difference between a heavy plate and a, and a squaggy suit is uh, dark minotaur will do one whole uh, heart of damage to you uh, on a squaggy suit, and an, uh, on uh, on a heavy plate, it's going to do half a heart. So very very strong. It looks like a holy water uh, or a rift kill for Blunt. That was a good there. kill. That was a good kill. He got healed and he killed off Paul Rift. And look at that Ring of Wonder, man. He has four damage right now. With and a titanium. strength charm for uh, Blimp now. Okay, five damage. I take that back. I'm a liar. And look at that. Oh, the, oh, and he has the Ring of Mana effect. I forgot about that. Nice. So now he has the the recharge time on the fireball. It's not a greater mana. It's not it's not a greater spell. Oh, and a little buffer on Blimp's side. Uh oh. Um, it's not a greater fireball. But it, it, it does, at least to my knowledge, um, it does give you the, the regen, though. So he can yeah. fire off that fireball constantly. Ooh, he's getting a little bit of trouble here. And so, um, and so let's see, looking over here, Dovanok is on 3-2. Uh, Blimp is on 3-1. 3, one, three for uh, JT and the 3-4, uh, the, three, four, the uh, uh, Zone 3 boss for a Pinball. It looks They're all actually pretty close. This is and really exciting that... Basically, uh, we know that Blimp is going to advance, um, and then between the other three, whoever finishes first of those three is going to advance as well, So, and the other exactly. two are out, so it's going to be a close race. We have three racers all very, very close to each other. Well, um, JT uh, picked up a green scroll, so that... Uh, That's big. If, now, if he yeah. knows to go to half a heart and pop it for a free potion does and actually uh pinball wizard did something i highly approve of he he has a pickaxe dug out that that uh, the, the wall pig thank you <laughs> yes i always try to kill the ham cannons if i can yeah going hey i like to go ham on the ham that's the thing <laughs> Ooh, and jt took a little bit of a hit not too bad i think he needs some boots now probably the last thing all these people need and looks like <laughs> ring of becoming sitting there for uh for jt but no transmute spell free spell though which oh. is pretty strong I wish the uh, Scroll of Need would, would change the Ring of Becoming into the Ring of Wonder. I think that would be appropriate. That That's actually pretty appropriate. It's like a free transmute or yeah. something. And like an in, in inventory. Ooh, hold on a second. JT kind of got a little swarmed there in the ooh, boss room. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Good, good. Has plenty of on. armor so it was a, and the floaty boots, so he's not going to get stuck on ooze. Exactly. Yeah. He would have died instantly. Because when you're on uh, ooze, P, uh, for anybody who doesn't know, if you're on the ooze, you take double damage. You can't attack, you can't dig, so you can't get out of it. Uh, so you gotta be very, very careful going around it. So it looks like uh, Pinball, uh, sorry, Pinball Blue, uh, Blimp is actually now on his own three boss, taking his time still doing that strat. Not a bad idea. Uh, meanwhile, we have JT on uh, zone four, uh, four two actually, about to go on four, four three. Is that a dagger of phasing he has? As yeah, he's been running the dagger yeah. phasing. Oh, it's, nice. it's, it's it's a very uh, like it requires you to get close to enemies, but it's really really good in zone yeah. in zone four. It it does. It'll kill it'll kill off your blade masters instantly. It will also allow you to uh, quick kill uh, dead ringer because now you don't have to worry about it. You hit him one. He, dead ringer only has two health. If you yeah. have more than two, you have more than um, uh, ten damage, or you have something that does facing damage, you will hit him for one heart. And then you just pop him again, hit him for another heart, he's dead. And, and speaking, speaking of that, dead ringer. Yep, let's see if he knows. Jay is first to dead nope. ringer. There we go, taking advantage of that, that dagger. 
Ah, that's perfect. Nice. Good kill. Who cares about the flaws in Den Rieger? I mean, if you're not a score runner, oh well. Exactly. Oop. So yeah, he's on his second dancer fight. Taking off. Blimp is on his 4-1, taking his time again. I think he's he's good, actually. It's like he can play second or even third in this race and still do just fine. And uh, yeah, look at that. A good quick kill. Oh, look at that. Taking advantage of that blood shovel. Nice. He has a he has Very nice. Of yeah, really yeah. smart play. Also, he kills the uh, mummy... And Man, Mommy the crown of thorns for uh, JT as well. That's well, it's, he's on Necro Dancer, so it's not that big, but not not that bad exactly. But yeah, uh, just to let you guys know, so um, the, the, one of the strongest parts about the blood shovel is exactly what you saw there: is that you can go up, walk right up to the the stage, and dig it out. You can do the same thing with the blood dr drum as well, but you need a little bit. I think you need a little bit more health. That one, and yep, there we go. JT puts it down. Oh, no. at, Ooh. Thirty-four <laughs> seconds. Oh. A really good happened? time. That's a that's a really good time. That was nice. That's a solid time. GG yeah. on that. And so now it's, it comes down to these three. We have um, interesting uh, approach for a pinball wizard. He, he's like, I have a million bombs. I'm just gonna get rid of the bells entirely. I don't like them. They they're an eyesore. Oh, they it's gonna be sad to see pinball wizard lose by so such a close race. He's just just on the necro dancer fight. A yep. little, just a little bit too late, because... A tad bit. Uh, too he little, too for, late. He opted for a slightly slower run, or a slightly uh, slower approach to Dead Ringer, but... Going up and doing a fast trade as well with the bombs. And, um, and uh, you know, uh, Blue Blip is now on the Dead Ringer fight as well. Dead Ringer too. Yep, and so it looks like uh, Dovanok is, is actually on 4-1 still. Yeah, Dovanok did fall behind a little bit there when 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 I said they were all close and it, he took a lot more time on to get through zone three. It took him a while. Yeah, it did. Let's see how Pinball Wizard handles this. He's gonna. Okay, here we go. There we go. Perfect. That's a flawless uh, dead ringer. And it looks like, it, but it might be a little too late because now we have Pinball Wizard coming in. Depends on how. Okay, cool. Get trolled. Yeah, literally. Oh, that. Oh, yeah. I, I like to call. Okay, so he, but he took care of the ogre. That's fine. Last hit, and there we go. GG there Pinball we go. Wizard. Nice GG going. Pinball Wizard. Also, pretty good time. I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm glad that I'm glad that they were able to shake it off and and get a finish here. Yeah. That uh, was yeah. After the first that, round, when when everyone struggled to survive. Game yeah. one, game one nerves. It really, it's just the way I feel is that you know you're really nervous when you when you start off and then you kind of calm down a little bit. You feel a little better. Yeah. Definitely. Well, beating the icebreaker is always the hardest thing to do. Yeah, exactly. It, it, exactly, Blind Empire. You have a good point. So uh, it looks like Blue Blip's going to finish off his run as well. Um, he's, oh, he's doing all the trapdoor strats. Ugh. Okay, there we go. And, you know, I don't know if anyone noticed, actually. I just noticed this, but um, Blimp ha has the Dove sprite. I did notice cadence. that. He's using Dove for Cadence. It's actually wow. kind of cool. I mean, <laughs> why not? Dove's not allowed to kill things. She has to say, oh, no. <laughs> She's a psychopath, are you kidding? <laughs> she, she stands on the spikes and watches things come up and kill themselves. She's like, oh no, sarcastically. Oh, okay, okay, okay there we go. Oh, be careful. Oh, there we go. Red right. dragon, oh my. He's like, oh, you know, oh, oh, oh. I haven't had a bath in a while, so I, I like to burn all my skin off. The only way to get clean. You're not yeah. clean until you're dragon fireball clean. Oh, yes. All right, here we go, and GG Blue Blimp as well. Go, yeah. He gets one point, moving himself up to four. Don't the lead. Yeah, much much smoother, much cleaner runs, and Dovanok now hitting uh, Dead Ringer. I like how Matt Kirby. It's Dove without the Dove. Quite, quite, quite seriously. Exactly. I think Dove's <laughs> Dove's like nobody will notice if I take this bird off my head that I'm not who I say I am. Stranger in a strange land. So it looks like Dovanok's on his Dead Ringer fight, but I think it's a little too late because he's yeah. going to get no points for that race. But, let, I mean, it's probably a good idea to let him finish anyways. Yeah. Oh, okay. Woo. Okay. There we go. Dead Ringer. Dead Ringer, uh, please, going please. a little off the rails here. Dead Ringer? Yeah, could, could you hit that bell, please? Uh, thank you. Thank there you. There we go. Be a bruh. What a bruh. Dove is... Rack the kitty. I completely agree. Dove is... Out of her mind, off her ringer, absolutely crazy, uh, crazy, crazy. Um, so yeah, it looks like Dovanok's going for the, the the bomb strat as well on Necro Dancer. That's why very important when you race. It's a good idea to try to hold on to three bombs uh, toward the end because yeah, you save some time going ahead, 
uh, in the other zones, but when it takes you an extra two minutes to, to knock the Necrodancer off his stage, because you don't have bombs or a blood shovel or a blood drum, um, that, you know, that, that can negate the entire time savings throughout yeah. the run. Uh, another, another uh, obviously, big thing uh, you could do is a ring of phasing with one bomb. You ring of phasing, go up to the stage, bomb the very center of it, with uh, including the Necrodancer and the loot, and you grab the loot, kill the Necrodancer. Or, or not kill him, but hit him. I don't think I've seen that strategy before, but I'm terrible with it's, the ring of phasing. It, it's it's actually world record. Uh, that's the world record. Oh. It's um it's you get a ring of phasing, you take it through, you skip most of zone four because you're in the walls, and then 